always start interrupting me. I can't believe this. How does it feel to not be a uh, wrench in chat, Mark? It's going to feel just as good as you're going to feel after the show. I'm looking forward to Mark typing and chatting in. When I troll <laughs> the living shit out of you. I want to time him out, too. Well, when he acts like a little kid, he gets put in the corner like a little kid. Dada? Yeah. Mama. You going to behave tonight, Mark? Uh, Probably not. No? Steve, Steve no. can you ever get me a coffee? Thanks. Can you have Steve get me a coffee, too, Mike? Steve, get two coffees. Thank you. You, you got any of that spine spinecopita or whatever that's called? No, nah, man. This ain't, this ain't no fucking restaurant. Fuck. Spinecopita? What? Uh, looks like there's some people in chat that are disliking the shameless plugs that we have. I would probably give... <clears throat> How is Mark going to eat hot dogs if he doesn't get paid? Who's this one person? I don't know. I like to I like to major in the minors, which is like take all the hundreds of people in chat and focus on the one person that says something negative. Yeah. Good evening, Sid. All right. Well, shameless plug time because we got bills to pay. So here we go. Fuck yeah, Mark. Fuck yeah. Son of a bitch. Mm. I hope you're going to take care of that question in the chat about their top side catching on fire. Uh, uh. Love my top side until it burns out. Should we roll right into the uh, 20 minute intro? Yeah, let's do it. Roll into the outro, too. Let's do the intro, outro, intro, outro, and then we'll we'll go into the buffet and then we'll finish up. All right, thanks. Let's do it. Let's do it. Thank you. Is there like a mid tro? There's a mid tro. I didn't receive my payment this month for vaping on the top side, so I'm probably not going to vape on it. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm already choked up. Mm. Alexa, call 911. Thank you, Mike. Hey Siri, call 911. Ignition! <laughs> we are live, 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 live. Welcome, everybody. It is the vape team, the motherfucking great team. Thursday night, back at that ass, and we have a fucking full show. We're talking double penetration full tonight because the guy that likes to take two in the stink, Mark Vapen Fagan, is with us this evening. Our special guest, the blue, up, motherfuckers? the blue thumb. He always has protection on that thumb to do some uh, shit jamming. Where's the fucking cover, Mark? Uh, I don't wear it during the show. Thank you. Alrighty, and with with us as always. The man with the master plan. No fucking joke. The king of bling. Yes, he loves jewelry. You can see him. He's got those fucking rope necklaces. Look at him. Look at him. Gold, baby. The king of clouds. Mount Olympus. Mr. Matchy Matchy. The matchstick man. The iron fucking lung, ladies and gentlemen. Mikey motherfucking vapes. <laughs> Thank you for the introduction. You're right. welcome. You're welcome, my friend. Good evening, chat. <clears throat> Sid. Good evening, Greg. Uh, I'd like to start off with a little bit of house cleaning this evening. Uh, Mark, I just want to tell you that if you act right and you start acting like a professional and you follow the rules in chat and be an example for those that are joining us in there, you get your uh, wrench back. All right. I guess he's not getting his wrench back. <laughs> That's me running. <sighs> I'm going to take that wrench and shove it up your ass. Dude. <laughs> Look at this. 
Oh, you got yourself an Infinex? Dude, I'm I'm back on the wagon. Back oh, on oh, damn, oh, shoot him off a little bit. Holy I'm, shit. I'm off the wagon. I what is um, yeah, I'm off the wagon. I'm Dude, off, I'm on, I'm on, I'm off the wagon. It's like getting back in with that ex that's abusive, and it just feels so fucking comfortable to be in the chaos. It's so true. She's Dude. a bitch, but man, can she suck a dick? It, that's what that's what gets you every time, doesn't it, Mark? It sure does. So yeah, I'm back to biting again. I'll be getting uh, caps put on my teeth soon. Um, but speaking of biting things, the guy that takes his dentures out so he doesn't bite things, we're going to go into a little buffet action. Mark, can you please tell everybody what you're not vaping? Well, <clears throat> since the uh, payment just came in about 10 seconds ago, I am vaping on the dual top side right there, wrong camera, uh, with the BTFC. Thank you, Dove Poe, for that payment. Uh, we got the, what is this thing called? The Bigfoot with the screen tank. For almost four weeks in a row, the, whew, I still don't remember the name of it. It's called the BTFC. The BTFC, there you go. Uh, the BTFC. other one is called the Ramadan. The Ramadan, there you go. And <laughs> the Aspire, whatever it's called. And we also got the little Anakin DV for some side action. Can I ask you a real quick question? Uh, if you're going to be quick, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead, <laughs> fucking put your donations in chat, you cocksucker. Agave. Oh, All right, Mark. So, herpes. Yeah. Two dollar donations. <laughs> I'm gonna pin Mark at MVE. Mark, you you're gonna have to wear a belt at MVE. I'm just saying, even that shelf booty is not gonna keep it up. Draw BZ. We got some very last. <laughs> Chuck and Trucker, two dollars. That's for Mark's buffet. There you and go. Mitchell Tally Jr. Two dollars just here to upset the buffet. Boom! Thank Buffet's you. been upset. Go ahead, Mark. Time is yours. Mark, what are you vaping on? I don't even know. Uh, I'm actually smoking tonight. I'm not vaping. <laughs> in, in order to keep payments flowing into your account to be on the show, Mark, I'm going to need you to dedicate at least 10 minutes of the show to a, a, a single buffet just by you. So let's keep this going tonight in order to keep the payments going. Uh, oh, hold on a second. Wait a minute. Gregory Brown, $5. Just to interrupt, Mark, I ordered my topside duel today. So there mm. you go. Thank you, Gregory Brown. I hope you love it. I fucking love it. Go ahead, Mark. Okay. Take it away. You have seven. Ryan. You have seven more minutes. Uh, oh, wait a minute, Tyler Rose, dollar ninety nine. Mark's buffet interruption. I'm just gonna sit here. Well, you go ahead. You have ten minutes. I'll screen share you. Go ahead. I got that. I got that. And that's all I got. Take it away, Brian. GD snuff two dollars. Hello, Mark. Love the show. Go ahead, Mark. Time is yours. I'm gonna fucking snuff you. I'm gonna. I said snuff ten you. minutes. Ten minutes. You got to earn I'm your keep on this. Snuff you, dude. Mike and I have had private meetings without you because you're a special guest. We've discussed backroom, you know, deals. We're looking for a replacement. We need a junior and front member. Front room deals too. Front room deals too. We've actually had conversations right in front of you, and you just didn't pay attention. Uh, Romeo Davila, two dollar donation. Shake it for daddy, Mark. Hashtag do it. Uh, Joel Pan this. Hennessy, I think it is. I like pizza. Uh oh, that was his comment. I like, I pizza. like pizza. Paniki? Is that Paniki? Or Panici? 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 Polish pizza? I think it's Panici, and it's not Polish, Mark. What is it? <clears throat> oh, wait, a wait a minute. Wait. What? 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 Uh, what were you just holding up, Mark? That was my blackboard. Blackboard for what? Not for, for my backgrounds, because oh, I don't. Okay, I was gonna say. I, I, I mean, it's bad enough. Others are copying. Mike, I'm not saying that he would copy you, but he'd copy you. Next thing you know, he'll have a camera system the way I got back there. No doubt, with arms and everything. We got some donations before we lose track. We got a donation from Ma77, $2 just to poop on Mark's Buffet. And Mike, you can read Gregory Brown. Uh, remember, uh, Gregory Brown, $2 donation. Remember, I set the standard for interrupting Mark. He really did. He was the originator of the Interrupt Buffet. Yes. It's coming, folks. You do, wait. Do you guys You're notice that when he gets interrupted, it makes no difference in our understanding of what's on in his buffet? It's coming. What? It's coming. What, heartburn tonight when you lay down to go to sleep? <laughs> what's Bloody coming, hemorrhoid. Mark? <laughs> Bloody hemorrhoid and heartburn. <laughs> All right, well, you're going to have to work up your uh, 
you're gonna have to work up your skills this week and pre- be prepared for next week's 10 minutes because we're gonna we're gonna make you i'm gonna have a, actually a timer on the desk here and we're gonna hold it up to the screen and we're gonna make you do it full 10 minutes so you need to you need to practice mark put a little time in all right as soon as you start can, practicing just, never mind can you acknowledge no, I can't actually right now. So you're not going to acknowledge your responsibility on the Would show. Would you get to your goddamn buffet? All right. You son of a bitch. I was just testing your patience, but obviously you can't control yourself in a professional way. 30 minutes in. in. The way. show's about over. Let's wrap it up. Dude, Play it's 10 11. And we're going to end early tonight because we've been going late every minutes. single week. All right. We wasted 11 minutes. All right. So I'm vaping on the Asmodus A Mighty Kit. It's a mighty good time right here. <laughs> it's at 30 watts, which I haven't Woo. vaped it yet. I filled it up, and I'm waiting for it to get saturated. But, yeah. So you're technically not even vaping on it, then. I'm vaping on it more than you're vaping on anything in your buffet. I've been vaping on the same stuff for the past three months. Yeah. It's called the whatchamacallit. All right, what else do I got? I got uh, my standard fare, which I vape every single day, the original top side with the recurve. I'm vaping on that. I got this uh, Asmodus Lustro Kodama with some... What the hell is this thing called? The blank? Yep, on top? the blank. The blank? Mmm. Yeah. There you go, the blank. I have, uh, well, the Smoke Infinix with a brand new bottle of Dinner Lady 50 milligram nicotine salts because, yeah, my, my tolerance definitely needs it. Um, I also am vaping on the PAL 2, the PAL version 2 from Artery. Um, I also have the DV. I'm pod heavy tonight. I'm going to be next salt in the lot. The DV. Uh, I'm also vaping a gift tonight. This is the vape team mod that I got to show love. Thank you, Mike, for sending me this. I'll cherish it forever. Thank you very much, my friend. Uh, I also have the drop dead with the top side fucking duel. He's definitely not vaping on that. No, not. He's burning all the cotton in there. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> <laughs> that's from like three weeks ago <laughs> how does that cotton look that's not too bad man uh, oh my God. <laughs> hey that's the setup when he, re- when he did the, re- uh, the presentation <laughs> <laughs> I'm vaping a presentation tonight uh, alright enough of the foolishness um, what else do I got uh, yeah a little bit of that a little hermaphrodite tonight the hermetic I also have a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of that, and that's Why it. does someone that doesn't do reviews vape on so much shit? <clears throat> Take it away, Mike. How do you haul <laughs> all that around with you all day? That's an awful lot of stuff. <laughs> Take it away, Mike. I'm hot. Is it hot in here? Yeah, it is hot. It's I'm having hot flashes, I think. It's from all them Nick salts. What's my camera? I can't even see it. There you go. All right. We got the down low camera working again. All right. Oh, did I just freeze up? Yes. That's what you get for spending $20,000 on cameras. (laughs) (laughs) Well, the fuck this shit. He's got too many buttons. He doesn't know what's what. (laughs) Hold up. Let me try one more time. Maybe it's just rusty. There you go. Working? Are we good? Yep, we're good. All right. I am vaping on the Overlord. This is a badass mech. Anybody was thinking about getting the Overlord from uh, God Mod Russia? This thing is dope. Twenty one seven hundred rebirth on top. Vaping on some this Apple Pa Chop Shop inside there. Also vaping on the I was going to call it the Robin on the, the rudder. With the, uh, shit, what's the name of this RTA again? The Salomon version 3 RTA. Dope RTA right here. Vaping on that, we got some uh, taffy splash inside there. There we go, some blue res. Also vaping on this uh, Minikin Kodama. Kodama. With the uh, Falcon King on top. Liquid inside. I don't remember what I have in Yes, juicy watermelon. So we got in there some juicy watermelon chop shop. I am also vaping on the top side, and I have another rebirth on top. And inside here, I have the same thing. I got that blue uh, 
Rast Happy Splash in there. We're also vaping on the Castigador, Widowmaker. Inside there, we have some Apricot and Cream Drip Fiends. And what else are you vaping on, Mike? Also vaping on the uh, Battles. Is it the Battlestar? Yeah, Battlestar Squonker thingy. Ding, 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 ding. With the Battlestar RDA. Vaping on that. And inside here, I have some of uh, Jabo's White Current. Where the hell's the bottle? So I can prove that I am vaping it. There you go, baby. Right there. White Current. What current and I do have a driplet of liquid there. What the fuck? It's just natural juices. <laughs> natural juices. Oh man, I was gonna try to put my tongue there and lick it off my finger. I can't reach over. <clears throat> That's it. That's it. Oh, I'm also vaping on one more thing. I have the Asmodus flu pot system. I'll be sipping on that a little bit too tonight. That's it. Take it away, Sid. There we go. All right. Uh, mm -hmm. Sid, should I open the room for Sid? I thought Sid was in here with us. He is. We just got a, a SEK donation, Mike. South uh, Korea? I think it's... Uh, Southeastern Korea. Southeastern Korea. Korea. Southeast That's a, Korea. Yes, Southeast Korea. 75, whatever that is. Uh, someone buy Brian a proper chew toy. There you go. I like a nice titty, like a full titty. Mm. That's what I'm into. We also got a $2 donation from Dustin Walls. Happy to catch the live show while stuck at work. Dude, we're sorry you're stuck at work, but we're glad to be there with you. Mark, do you know what it feels like to work? Uh, we could phone <laughs> in a bomb threat if you like. Mark, Let's don't see. make those fucking comments on the show, you bastard. Uh, I meant like a, like a fart bomb. Yes. Like a gas bomb, you know, like not like a bomb. See, bomb. that's what happens yeah. when, Mark, when Mark fucking acts out, everybody pays. That's what I'm saying. Go ahead, Mark. <laughs> take it away. Take it away. Play, cl <laughs> play clean up. Go ahead. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> you got yourself into a little bit of trouble, Mark. Do we have an agenda today? We have an agenda, but we're not at the agenda yet. I just want to say oh. this. So I had some, you know, obviously we all have different moments in our lives where things happen, good and bad, and we have moments of, you know, accomplishments and success, and we have moments of failure and moments of loss. Here we um, go. I just want to say that it, it sucks that sometimes in life we have to go through shit in order to feel connected with other people that are going through shit. You know what I mean? Are we it's, doing a, like an after school special? I'm trying to connect with people in the audience, oh, Mark. I'm sorry. Go ahead. So I just want to say, if there's anybody out there that's struggling right now, if there's anybody out there that's going through a time of loss, if you have any family members that are sick, if you're going through, um, you know, feeling lonely or you're, if you're, if you're fed up, just breathe in, man, and know that you're not alone. Like, it's not like you're going through it by yourself and the whole world around you. Everybody's doing okay. Every single person alive has ups and downs, and we all struggle and we have hardships. So just know that, you know, you're not alone with it. That's all. I had a fucking pretty rough week this week, and uh, I want to sh sh send some love to Miss Amy Relish. Um, and, uh, yeah. That was it's pretty deep. We Amen. get caught up in our own shit, you know what I mean? We get should you. want to want to say a prayer real quick. Go ahead. All right, let's do it. Make a mockery. Anyway, thank you, thank you, Mark. That was fucking beautiful. Thank you, Mark. Thank you. Anyway, it looks like Stand Up 3D's out there. Shout out to Stand Up 3D. My oh, man, Jesse. Yep. Uh, Steven Eagles, love you, Brian. Stay strong, bud. Dollar ninety nine. Thank you very much. And um, I, I guess I want to, real quick, a little elephant in the room action because I know people have been talking about it. Um, there is a little. I wouldn't even call it drama. I would. I would say that there is. <clears throat> okay, so we're a passionate group of people, right? And human human beings are like. We, we form 
small little groups and we have, you know, little, first of all, I don't want anybody to be in a group that I represent because I'll fucking fall short. You know, I want you, everyone to be a community that connects with everybody. And there, the, sometimes there's a gang mentality that happens and you can see it in the media all the time when there's like a news story and everybody jumps down the throat and people want to pitch, hold pitchforks up and, and stab at people and be the judge, jury and executioner. And when it comes to the vape community, I think we need to, whenever we feel that reaction, like we want to lash out, we need to take a deep breath and step back and be more rational and think things through. Give it a day before you react, like 24 hours, and then come back at it. Um, you know, there was a review this week that there was a lot of drama involved with it. I was getting messages all day, every day. <coughs> And the truth is, is that every single person that does YouTube has the capability to be free to express what they want, how they want it, and the outcome of whatever they do is on them. So we don't need to, to attack people on personal levels. We don't need to threaten people. We can give our opinions too because you, the viewers, have just as much of an opinion as the people doing the content themselves. But just realize that this is not like, it doesn't need to be so fucking serious. We don't need to like crucify people because the truth is like in two days, everything's forgotten and it's on to the next thing. So allow people to have their opinions, allow people to make their own choices and recognize their own, uh, you know, things and, and let it be that. So. Well, now I'm depressed. I'm not trying to depress you. Can we have a moment of silence? <laughs> Another one. <laughs> Oh, this is getting too deep. Yeah, where do we begin now? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, so I'm going to have some coffee. Hold on. <laughs> well, how about that football game? <laughs> Dude, who's going to win this weekend? That's what I want to know. Are, are we Mark? all going to... Take it away, Mark. <laughs> uh, I have not a clue who's playing, who's going to win. My money is on whatever team Brian likes. Hopefully they lose. I don't know. <laughs> All I know is at least one. Or at least we know one team is going to win the Stanley Cup. <laughs> Stanley. <Cup. laughs> vape Ross Vape two dollar donation. East Coast over West. We dropped the goat. I have no clue what that means. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. I don't take Xanax. Maybe I should, but I don't. No, no Xanax. No Xanax for this guy. I'm 100% natural. Hell yeah. So, Mark, uh, well, we know Brian doesn't review, so it doesn't yep. affect him. Thank you. Are you looking forward to uh, China going on vacation? Yes. <laughs> but I, I do have a big box of Asmodis products, so I'm not really looking forward to that. But other than that, yes, I'm looking very forward to China going on vacation. Mm -hmm. Very happy about it. They're like, we're gone for what, two weeks, three weeks? Uh, about two weeks but you figure by the time they get to work and then they end up shipping anything out so you're looking at about two weeks a little over two weeks oh it's gonna be so nice we so quiet we could do videos you actually want to do and I'm looking forward to it uh yeah. pal 702 five dollars he said the top side duel feels better than fagan in the hand i don't know about that dude hmm. fagan fagan hits like just index finger height you know what i mean he, he fits they right in me, here. They call me two fingers in high school. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, Carl says, uh, is that vaping with Vic's Asmodis stuff that you have, Mark? Actually, uh, Mark's the one I broke into his house. Funny thing is, I actually bought this box of uh, Asmodis stuff off some dude in the street for like 25 bucks. <laughs> so I'm gonna, <laughs> People are going to no, this is As Asmodis sent out this box to a lot of the reviewers, I guess maybe to keep them busy while they were gone, so... You guys are going to see a lot of Asmodis shit on a lot of channels. But the thing is, Asmodis isn't going anywhere. They're in the States. Oh, they're not? Oh, well. <laughs> well, they're in California. Well, they're manufacturing places in China, though. Well, yeah, but they have the products. Oh. It's Why do they send all box of shit, though? I don't get it. Well, this is a lot of the stuff that you got were stuff that came out maybe like it's old, That's right? It's out already, yeah. yeah it's like also, they, they want to make sure that all the, the distribution companies and all the shops get a supply of these products before they leave for this long break. Because yeah. there's always the, 
the and you guys know how it is like when it comes to like Christmas time and it's like a week before and people stop paying attention they don't work as hard at the office they start getting a little bit lazy you know that's what's going to happen for all these people so there's a slowdown at the end of January <clears throat> there's the the delay and then when they come back they a lot of the workers are new and they have to relearn everything and it takes a couple weeks to get the flow back going again mm-hmm. uh it looks like also some what is that Luis MMO Luisi MMO is that what it is Mark read that for me Lu- Luis Luisimo hey, Luis. Luisimo Stethizi! Uh, suck the dick and the fuck the butt! Hey, pesce and bocca! Hey! The balls, huh? The bibbidi bippi! You suck the balls! Two dollars. Grim said the OG topside is his favorite squonk on the vlog. Yeah, Grim said that in his original uh, topside review. So, yeah. I, so then he should like, then I would assume the dual topside is his favorite since it's the same thing. Oh, we're starting with this. No, again. there's no. I'm not even going to bring it up. <laughs> He's entitled to feel anything he wants about the shape of the topside duel. No Ultimate, ultimately, the market is the, the end-all, be-all in deciding if they find it comfortable, if they find it good for them, and if it works. If not, then, you know, we all have lessons to learn. I don't have any problem with subjective cons for devices. I look at everything close, and I listen to feedback. That's what Timothy the fuck you have Starberry, to do. If you don't hey, do Mike, that, just, you don't have successful products. Thanks, Mark. Go ahead. I just want to say thanks for the extra RDA and pod that came with my order today. Love you guys and everything you do. Hashtag the vape team. Great team. Hashtag Fagan is the best on YouTube. Oh, nice. That part was, wasn't that. <laughs> it's on my monitor for some reason. Uh, but, so, Brian, I saw you were vaping on that new RDA, the blank. Yes. How is it? Why don't I take a full pull right here? Why can't you say the name of it? I'll let you know. It's called... I I just said the name of it. Oh, the blank. I I thought you were talking about the uh, mighty. No, the blank. I thought you were making the blank. (laughs) can't say it on YouTube. (laughs) (laughs) Whoa, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. I'll take a fucking pull. I got it right here. It's ready to roll. Look. All right, wait. Press the fire button while you're holding it up there. I just fired it. No, no, right there. Fire just, it now. No, don't go down. He's not even using it. I, no, there's no building. What are you fucking talking about? There's no building. Uh, Look at that. Deep fucking pulls. It's incredible. <laughs> Let me see your build. You want to see the resistance? Is it a dual coil or single coil? Uh, there might. I don't. Just know. so everyone knows, Brian actually. <laughs> 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 on Thursday and sometimes on Sunday. I'm having a problem. All right, I was gonna let me vape on this though because this is really what I've been focusing all my energy on. The Almighty. Here we go. You know what I have in the Almighty? Do you want to know, Mark? What happened? Hold on. Are you paying attention? The fuck is that? Oh, Sounds like an alp an outboard rudder on a boat. So check this out. This is the blank. What? I don't see what the problem is, but all right. There's the blank RDA. Oh, they don't want you to release the name yet? Looks pretty blank. Uh, Yeah. Airflow comes in from up here. Yes. Through this. And the airflow is adjustable. Yep. Top cap. Airflow. It's a top airflow. Oh, what's this? 810 with the... Oh, this fit regular 810s? Oh, come on, Asmodus. It doesn't? Seriously? Well, that's an absolute fail. An RDA. But it's not 810 compatible. Do they have an, adap- oh, oh, oh. an adapter in the kit? Huh? Is there, like, an adapter, maybe? For No, uh, it's not adapter. They, they made it... Proprietary? Yeah, I don't know what these. Like sometimes I just don't. Sometimes companies are just out of touch. Isn't it always the little things that make the biggest difference? It does make a big difference. A lot of people are gonna want to put their own drip tips on shit. Yep, it makes a huge difference. Uh, a lot of people don't even. Some people don't even care how good it vapes. Once they hear that they cannot use their drip tips, they don't even want to deal with it. Yep. That's how you adjust the airflow. You can see it opening up right there, by turning. Wow, what a letdown. 
What's so secretive about the name? What do you mean? Why can't you guys say the name of the RDA? The RDA is called the blank. All right, never mind. You don't want to what say that. What are you even first? talking about, Mark? We're talking about Asmodus' new RDA. He blank. doesn't know anything. If you guys don't want to say the name of the RDA, then don't. Just keep it under wrap. That's fine. All right, Mark, we're just keeping it a secret from you. Apparently so. Yes. And uh, 800 people watching. Yes. I'm pretty sure people in chat would like to how know the name you, of it. How do yeah, people in chat feel about proprietary drip tips? Yeah, it's in chat right now. A lot of people are saying they totally agree. Uh, Mark's, because the name is blank, fill in the blank, he's making a joke. Dude, Mark's uh, yeah. brain is blank. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't joking. Anyway, it's proprietary with one of these things. So I have something here. Do I have something here? Yeah, I do have. I have this... Here's an A10 with the O-ring. That's very loose in there. No good. I'm going to use this drip tip here. This is a drip tip from Horizon Tech. Very loose inside there. This is like it's it's like its own size that they made for it. Yeah. No adapter. That's crazy. Fail. Better vape good. <clears throat> I thought it was interesting on the uh, Mighty Kit, the single 21700 mod that they have here, 100 watts. Uh -huh. real, real nice screen. Beautiful looking. Um, I was a little in... It doesn't have any magnets on this door. That's it's how like, the uh, Minikin 2 used look to at be. The, dude, look at this shit. Fucking Amy Relish writes her name on batteries, mm. and then she yells at me for using them, even though I bought them. Unbelievable. Isn't, like, aren't you supposed to share and care in a marriage? Hell yeah. Yeah. All right, let's get out of this. So this is a little uh, mesh, t uh, I don't know, mesh um, sub -ohm tank type of thing. That came in this kit, the Mighty Kit. And, uh... Oh, let me show the mesh mod. A lot of people the airflow is a little, a little wishy. You know what I mean? A little bushy. Yeah, usually with mesh coils, it's going to be a little bit on the... Let me turn down the air a little bit. Yeah, it's real wishy. <clears throat> that beauty. That's sexy. It looks like a meat-seeking missile. That's fucking dope. Where's that mod from? Russia. Russia? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, that's... What's the name of that mod? Overlord. Oh, okay. Well, that's nice. Uh, Amy, Relish Donation. Mike, please tell him I bought them. Well, she did buy them, actually. She bought them off my site. Okay, let me just make something clear. I bought them on your site. Amy Relish, first of all, I don't know if you guys know this, but her account got hacked earlier in the day. So I wouldn't believe anything posted by her in chat. <laughs> oh yeah that thing is sexy Mike I remember the first time I saw this I was like oh my god I can't wait to get that in my hands this is it's gorgeous I love this part here the only thing I thought about it was will it be uncomfortable in the hand is it but, no because if you like this if you like to do that it's perfect Wow, it's fucking perfect. The Cali grip. Yeah. I love this thing. Uh, Chuck and Trucker, $2. How do I buy Russia mods, Mike? Go to Russia. Let me see. There we go. Uh, you can buy it right off of their Instagram. If you go on their God Mods Instagram, they'll set you all up to purchase it. There's a lot. Of, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of people here in chat that have bought straight from them from Instagram beautiful the brewski I've been seeing a ton of bestia uh, hand checks on all the Facebook groups lots of people are loving the bestia right now yeah. big time how she hit Mike she hits pretty damn good it's funny because I bought Angela that bestia and she hasn't used it once have you used it not really but she wanted it so bad. 
she bought it and <laughs> never used it. I find myself not using my tube max, and the only reason is, is I'm so fucking used to squonking now because it's so convenient that I just find the only time I'm ever using my max is like when I'm sitting at the desk and I'm just dripping. Like I don't take bottles with me and drip in the car. I don't drip when I'm around the house doing stuff. It's only when I'm sitting down at the desk and I want to drip. So I find myself yeah. using them less and less nowadays. Uh, Erica Vapes, Mike, did you get your White Dreamer yet? Yeah, I shot it off last week. There we go. There's the White Dreamer. If it'll focus in, there we go. I took the button from my switch from the uh, Black Dreamer and just swapped it out. Yeah, maybe. Do a white drip tip on there. That's so... <clears throat> We have a message from PSS from a Canadian $5. Canada is north of Chicago, Mark. North is up. Uh, Brian, don't you know what's hers is hers, what's yours is hers. Happy wife, happy life. Ain't that the fucking truth? Couldn't have said it better. You know. Mark, do you feel like that's true? No. No, you feel like what's yours is yours, what's hers is yours? That's a really old saying, and I think it needs to be, like, updated or modernized, like, no. Mark's like happy man when he's on the can. <laughs> Did you ever serve you dinner on the can, Mark? No, I I mean I've eaten before while I was taking a shit a few times, but I've never been served on a toilet. Oh, uh, Mike Berg. Yeah, Mike Berg I think has the overlord. So there you go. I like Max. I'm just so used to adjusting my wattage to whatever I like it and not having to constantly swap batteries out and not traveling with batteries and how do you how do you guys feel about devices like this where you have that mechanical tube look but you have a, it's regulated and there's a board not enough wattage for me not enough yeah. wattage I'd rather use a tube I I my build determines my wattage so I already know when I I already know my coils I'm gonna throw my max I primarily vape on Mex. Yeah. The majority of the time, that's what I'm vaping on. Whether it's a, it's a Mech tube. I always got a Mech tube running. I always got a Mech squonker. There's always one of each going at all times in there. Yeah. I think something like this, like a 21700, 90 watt, 100 watt version of this would actually suit a lot of people's needs because you get that protection built in and it just feels comfortable. It fires from the side. There's a button. Mm-hmm. You know, that might be a good good something with, with you. I heard UL was coming out with something like that. So I'm sure they'll... they could come out with something. If they were to come out with something like that, that could do at least 120 watts. Yeah. With uh, And obviously it's going to do it with the correct battery inside there. That'd be great. They have to make it a lot more efficient than this, though. The efficiency on this was just so poor. So poor. Is that the Nanchaku whatever? Yeah, the Nanchaku. I guess if you were vaping at like 20, 25 watts on the Nunchaku, it might have been good. But if you're pumping that thing up to max, you're going to – you're 10 minutes, 15 minutes, it's going to be fucking shot. And they are making a – I think I heard they are going to make a 21700 version. Yes. Oh, yeah. Pretty nice. Yeah, I liked it for vaping like 50 watts or so. But if you crank it up, you're swapping batteries out all the time. <coughs> By the way, Mike <coughs> – Congratulations on the rebirth. All I see every day on all social media is how much people are loving it. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, people are like in love with the rebirth. So. Yep. Thanks, home, man. Home run, man. It is an awesome RDA. Yep. The airflow is just absolutely perfect. Yep. I even saw a post where a guy bored out his airflow. <laughs> Damn. Did what? He like he like increased the airflow on it himself. What did he do? I guess he used a drill bit and like drilled out some of the holes more. Maybe oh, he, he like made bigger holes. I guess. By the way, I'm not saying to do that because you might mess up and make it turbulent if you don't know what you're doing. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I've seen a lot of people, man. You can always tell if something's trending by how many posts you see of people being satisfied in different yeah. groups. Uh, Holden Tudix. I noticed you keep saying my name. I don't know why, but uh. Holden two dicks. Oh, holding two dicks. Oh, wow. That took a while to. Mm-hmm. Yep, it to always does. Yep. Uh, someone in chat much. said that they're, they, they're, I guess, getting the El Thunder, the new one. Uh, me personally, I'm really not too into this El Thunder mechanical mod. 
I love the fucking build quality, the paint on this thing. This is just a beautiful finish that they did on this thing. It's just gorgeous. But uh, I'm not digging the, uh, first of all, serious battery rattle. Just going like this, ba battery just bang, bangs around inside here. Oh, what a pain. With a 21700. Is that a different mod than your? That's an L Thunder too. I wonder if it's. Yeah, this is their new. This is their 21700. Oh, uh, okay. L Thunder. But it's it's shaped differently. I kind of like the way yours is shaped. I don't like this. Actually, I ain't going to focus. It wants to be that person right now. I don't like the top. Oh, yeah, I could see it. See yeah. it just goes in? Yeah. I don't like that. that what, does it go, what does it go into, Mike 24? Yeah. And this part should have been up here. In my opinion. I yeah. think it should have been. I don't know. I just don't like the way that is. And anything I put on here, just wobble. battery, 21700s, wobble around inside here. Uh, yeah, I was really, like, let down on this one. I mean, this is pretty cool, the way they have it set up. I mean, I don't know how yours is. It's yeah, it's got the yeah, same. Yep, almost the same, but yeah, same way. So when I take a 21700, pop it in. I'm not going to fully tighten it. We'll take off. And I know it comes with two different uh, of these pieces here, the contacts. One is for a shorter throw, one's for a longer throw. I've tried both because the guy was telling me, that's impossible. He was telling me, you need to switch out the thing. I told him I have, man. I ain't stupid. Chester, I switched that out. Chester, a millionaire, donated $2. He said, this is for Mike and Brian to talk over Mark all night. So thank you, Chester. Chest hair. I'm gonna fucking. <clears throat> you wait. That's all I got to say is you wait. You hear it? Yep. Yep. That's a hell of a rattle right there. Yeah, so the battery just rattles around in there. Uh, go check Todd's reviews. Why would I check Todd's reviews? He's gonna, what, tell me how to put the battery in the proper way? Maybe. Battery is, is in the proper way. Mike, those little prongs that are coming down. Yeah, this piece here comes out. You stick an Allen key through here, and you pop it out. There's two different ones. One is for shorter throw, one's for longer throw. I've tried both, and they, bo and they both give me the same. They both basically make the battery rattle. It don't matter what I do in there. Yeah. There were some people that said there might be a ring to make it tighter. No, there is no ring. No ring? No. Nope. It comes with uh, all kinds of other attachments for 27. When I put a 2700 in here or an 18650, it's fine. But when I use the 21700, it doesn't. Let me try a Galisi. Galisi's the bigger batteries. Uh, probably the Galisi will be fine in there. Hmm. Very little wobble. This not as bad. Here. Yeah, very little. Yeah, so that is weird. You would think like companies would, when they make a mech mod, they would size it up with a bunch of different batteries. We had that same problem with the. Uh... Yeah, it's not even that. It's more also the. Yeah, it all depends also on the RDA you're using. And how far the pin is out. Yes. Yeah. So, I don't know. I've tried a few RDAs already, and it doesn't. Um, every one I've tried so far, it's done. So, I don't know what to do. I don't know. If anybody has any uh, recommendations for Mike, uh, you can message him. Well, there's a guy telling me that I'm do doing everything totally wrong in the chat. The guy that actually said he's got one coming. Yeah. So, uh, I, know. I know I'm not doing anything wrong with it. So. Oh, okay. Mike did just start using mech mod, so yeah. Today's my first day using a mech. <laughs> I tried everything. I've tried troubleshooting it with the guy and everything. Mark takes the paper, uh, the uh, wrapper off the battery, and puts a paper clip around it. Actually, I wrap it in foil, nice. fatten it up, and then I put it in. Very good, Mark. Thank you. By the way, anybody listening to the show, do not ever do that. Nope, don't do it. Don't do it. 
All right, we got an agenda because oh, that's what no, we do we on this it? show. We have an agenda. Oh, no. So <clears throat> we're going to start off the agenda with checking out Hit That Juice for all your vaping needs. She just ordered coils, and they got here super speedy. It was the super speediest shipping ever, according to some lady. So there you go. Uh, big shout out and happy birthday to Scott Zegans. So happy birthday to Scott Zegans. Oh, happy shout birthday. out. Shua, shout out to Scott Zegans. There we go. We're going to give him a little uh, advertisement. U.S. Vape Promotions. There Scott you go. Zegans. There's Scott Zegans. Contact info. If you guys need anything promoted out there in the vaping industry, contact Scott Zegans. Everybody's got an agenda, and we have the relish agenda here on the show. And uh, she wants you Hold to on. check out. Did you make a little thing for the agenda? A little clip? There's no clip for the agenda. Oh, come on. Why don't you make the fucking clip for the agenda? Take it away. All right. Uh, check out Royal Vape. Check out RoyalVapeIOM.com. RoyalVapeIOM.com. And that's the home of – who, who owns that, Mike? Oh, so Mother F and Turner. Royal Vapes. Dot, I'm sorry. Royal Vapes IOM. I don't know. That's a strange website. Is it Royal Vapes or Royal Vape IOM? Royal Vapes. Royal Vapes IOM. IOM.com. He has, uh, he's got top sides. So if you're in the UK, check it out. He's got top sides there, the duels. He's got rebirths in stock. He has a sale going on for Hit That Juice and Hit That Donut. Check him out. Check him out. Show Mother uh, F and Turner. And get Chris, yourself some raspberry custard from there, too. Royal Vape products, baby. There's the website in chat. RoyalVapesIOM.com if you're in the UK. There we go. Uh, you can also get the delicious e-liquid that Joe Turner has on the website, too. So if you're heading over there and you're going to pick up a mod or something or an RDA, pick up some e-liquid there. And uh, say hi to Joe Turner. All right, what's up next? Oh, we're going to play yeah, a little... From Christopher Murdoch. You want to read it? You want me to read it? You can read it, Mark, if you can read. Mike and Brian, here's a little cash for having to put up with Mark for yet another show. Mike, looking to buy uh, a new mech tube. What would you? What would be your suggestion for a 2700 tube? 20... Thank you, Christopher, for that $10 Canadian or Californian, whatever it is. Thank you. California money. Thank you. All right, what's the question? I'll actually be read this thing because I wasn't paying attention. 2700 mech tube recommendation. Uh, well, you're going to get a 21700 because you're going to fit a 2700 in there. If you want a 21700, uh, budget wise, if you want to buy something um, from China, China made, designed by US uh, reviewer, get the Dreamer. Dreamer is a good choice. Uh, you want to buy another one that's made in the U.S. that's pretty good, the Vindicator, Kennedy. You want to buy Russian? Yeah, definitely this over Overlord right here. This thing is sick. That's a good one. There's a lot of good ones. I love this one, too, this Russian one. I have a full review on this, too. This thing is badass. This one fits 18650, 2700, and 21700. And it also fits... 2650s. Oh, yeah. 2650. Uh, yeah, four batteries in that. We are in for a real treat tonight, guys. Oh, no. We're in for a real treat. This is where Mark earns the money right right now. We have I a little game. We have a game. It's called The Special Guest Truth or Dare. Bum, bum, bum. Little game show tonight, guys. This is going to be starring Little Boy Red. And uh, we're going to be doing a little truth or dare with Mark. Mark, do you agree to follow through with all of the truth, and nothing but the truth, and you'll do the dares? Sure, but why is it only me and why not everybody on the panel? Because it's fucking hilarious. Oh, my God. Take it's one nice for the I'm team a... like you do at the rest area. I'm not a fucking sideshow freak. No, you're a size queen. <laughs> <laughs> we all know that. Now, while Mark is doing the truth or dare, Mike is going to be doing hand checks for every mod in his vape cave. So he's going to be the uh, eye candy. It's like the Home Shopping Network, but with truth or dare. Now, hold up. Let me just interrupt you one second. You can. If you want a strictly a 2700 mechanical mod, if that's what you want, 2700. 
the US-1. Yes. What's it called again? This is the Interceptor US-1. I forgot about that one. This one is a 2700 one right here. There you go. Uh, TrinityGlassHardware.com. <clears throat> So for those that don't know, every single week we post questions, comments, concerns in the Vape Team Facebook group. So if you're not a member of the Vape Team Facebook group, head on over there, answer three simple questions, and you'll be let in by the beautiful admins that we have over there. But Relish always puts something up before the show every week, and you guys help formulate this part of the show. Tyler Rose, 499, just want to say Amy is so pretty, Brian is a lucky son of a bitch. Thank you very much, Tyler Rose, and I completely agree with you. Way to be creepy, Tyler. Good job. Hey, check out the comment after Tyler Moore, Tyler Rose. I mean, the guy's name. Mark's trash mod. Oh, <laughs> I knew it was still out there. Dude, can you imagine the sad face that that thing has right now in some landfill? I'm it's pretty just, sure there's some happy son of a bitch out there that got it out of the garbage. Pay attention to me. I'm lonely. <laughs> I will do anything for money. There you go. Yes. Gay for pay is the way. Mark, are you still in uh, collaboration <clears throat> uh, with them? Actually, that was a really comfortable hat. But I am now enjoying this fine hat from EVH. Is it EVH? No, EV it's not. Emergency Vape Stash. EVS. My bad. I'm thinking Van Halen. There you go. Alrighty. So, truth or dare time, Mark. You're going to go through all the truths, all the dares, because people took their time to answer these questions. So, what do you want to do first? Truth or dare? I guess the truth. All right, let's hear the truth. For this is from Steve Thompson. He said, "Have you ever done <laughs> anything that was kind of sexual with another male?" <sighs> the answer is fucking yes, obviously. Kinda, like kind of sexual? Yeah. Uh, never. I mean, no, never, never touched or anything like that. No, never watched a guy jerk off. <laughs> so I'm probably, I'm probably saying minute. no. Why did you have to think about this? I've been in threesomes where there were two dudes and a chick, but there's never any... Any ball any bag kind of, play? No ball bag touching, nothing like that. Were you, like, staring at him most of the time? No, no, no. <laughs> there was long eye contact, Mike. You think that happened? This is... This uh -huh. is the funny long thing time. is I've actually been in a room with you watching trannies before. So you're lying. You actually have watched. Not, not but never. Nah, tried. you're getting tongue twined. All right, let, let's see if we can increase the honesty as we continue. <laughs> this is from Shane Mims. Uh, by the way, truth or dare? Go ahead. Uh, stick with the truth. All right, here we go. Shane Mims, truth. What's the worst thing you have done at a truck stop? Uh, flush my underwear down the toilet. <laughs> Why? Because I shit my pants. <laughs> Did you go commando after you flushed the, the underpants? Yes. I wiped my ass. I had shit everywhere. And <laughs> underwear and... So what did you do? Go in there, slowly slide the dirty drawers off so you wouldn't get shit all over your I legs? I get naked in the stall. And <laughs> I used the entire, like, fucking industrial-sized roll of toilet paper to clean my ass. And then I flushed the underwear down the toilet. Thankfully, they went down and put my pants on, even though I still smell like shit. And... Uh. Were you by yourself on the road, or were you with people? I was with my parents, I think. <laughs> I was pretty old, too. I was, like, in my teens, so. <laughs> Could you imagine being at the rest area, and, like, have, you pull off the side of the road, you're clenching your cheeks to go take a shit, the door's not, the lock doesn't completely lock, you open the door, and there's a nude Mark sitting there taking oh, uh, dirty underpants off? Dude, I guarantee you, at least 50% of the men in chat have flushed a pair of underwear once in their lifetime. Oh, I have. Everyone has done it. I hot wash underpants all the time that I shit. <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you about hot washing at another time. But anyway, uh, let's continue on. This is not truth for us. This is the truth for you. So no, here we go. This is from Dustin Beaver or Beaver. Uh, is it true Mark had to pay Tiger Tech to make the nada? That is very untrue. Sadly enough, they paid me a little bit, but yeah, not enough. Not enough. All right, well, let's move on to the dares. Uh, we're going to start with um, we'll start with these two because I think these are more doable. Uh, uh, Connor Parker, dare. He said, sniff pepper without sneezing. Oh, jeez, we get pepper. Hold on. Pepper, 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 pepper. <laughs> this is going to be the best. 
Yeah, we have other good ones. We have, I dare you to run around your street in just your underwear, holding Pig Stacy, yelling, holy shit, it fell off. <laughs> Dude, we got to get Angela to, to videotape it. Yes, yes, definitely. Where Amy, we Amy, if you're watching, get Angela. No, don't get Angela. All right, here we go, some pepper. There's some drum roll. Maybe a little more. <laughs> there we Dude. go. There you go. Well, he did it, ladies and gentlemen. A round of applause for Mark. All right, Mark. Shit's going to get a little bit more deep now. You like it deep? Oh, I love it deep. We're going real deep. All right. Here we go. This is from Pipertron <laughs> Matthew Howell. <laughs> Face. <laughs> Dude, give me gas. So this question is, I dare you to bulk an Adidas shirt. Whoa! <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, will he do it, ladies and gentlemen? Dude, I don't even know because these are these are they're, like quality, they're your good, quality they're, That's your good shirt right there. Mark, you don't have to do everything. You don't have to. Mm. There's no pressure. It's one of my good ones too. I no like the hole. I like the red one. You maybe at the very end of the show I'll do it. Okay. Let's continue because we got a, we got a bunch more. Um, so the, actually, this can go at the end too because it says bulk bulk and put whipped cream on your nips. I dare you. Why do I have a feeling there's like dudes out there watching and masturbating? <laughs> well, I think these are all sexual requests. Yes, I think they are too. Um, to be honest with you. Carlos Cordero said, I second the bulk, but I say put whipped cream on his eyeballs. Feel the burn, Fagan. Don't do that for real. It might actually hurt. John Plew said, I dare Mark to bulk his favorite Adidas shirt. Ryan Pringle said, I triple dog dare Mark to bulk his favorite Adidas shirt. David He's McCormick said, uh, a good dare to let Angela smack you in the balls with a dildo. Whoa. Um, that would hurt. There's some things we can't do. We'll have to do it in the future. Dustin Beaver said, I dare Mark to see how many hot dogs he can eat in one minute. Um, Jason Witt said, I dare Mark to go do a snow angel in his boxers. Shit. And, uh, we're not going to do that one cause it might be taken the wrong way. And l let's do this one. You ready, Mark? This is the final one. This is the final one. Are you ready? I'm not ready, but go ahead. Mark, this is from Ray McNally. Mark, I dare you to run around your street in <laughs> just your underwear, holding pink Stacy yelling, holy shit, it <laughs> fell off. <laughs> that would probably have to be saved. I don't know if I could do that. Could I do yeah, that? Sure. Actually, you could do it. You're going to have Angelo record it, and then you're going to upload the video on the vape scene. Oh, there I could do that. Yeah, I could definitely do that. There you go. That could happen, folks. So we're going to see that happening. There's more to be revealed, guys. So, Mark, I'd like to thank you for the half truths. Uh, I believe you lied on the first question on the, the truth section. Uh, we'll talk about that again on another show. But uh, the yeah, dare. Yeah more prepared next week obviously you've snorted things up your nose many times in the past so i appreciate you doing the uh the pepper i feel like i'm going to sneeze but it's not coming yet and i'd like to thank amy relish for coming up with these beautiful truth or dare questions thank you amy there you go you. Uh, we do have some giveaways you guys ready for some giveaways is chat ready for some giveaways yeah are we ready i'm ready are you oh, ready wait for the x ones Fate Team Live Giveaway. All right, guys. First of all, I would like to thank, actually, not just me, Mark and Mike and myself, would like to personally thank Galisi. Because when I'm rocking a device and I'm like, I like to slide something in it, I like to rock a little bit of Galisi action. G O L, drop on the floor, L I S I, Galisi. Thank you. Galisi. Galicia. I'd also like to thank Hellvape. Check out Hellvape. You got the Drop Dead. You got the Dead Rabbit. You got the Rebirth. You got all kinds of other shit. They're killing it right now. So Hellvape. Also Vape Fly for the Pixie. The Brumhild. The Core RTA. The Core RTA. A whole bunch of stuff. And if you're looking for these devices, if you're looking for e-liquid, vape products, whatever you need. You need coils. You need a mod. You need batteries. Whatever you need. ElementVape.com. For all your vaping needs, check it out. So thank you very much. So 
the giveaway that we're going to do tonight, and if, if you win this giveaway, there's real simple instructions, and I'm going to give them to you right now. You need to email Amy Relish, Amy Relish at gmail.com. And in the subject line, you need to put what you won. Okay. Then below in the body of the email, you need to put your name, your address, your telephone number, and that's it. Your name, address, and telephone number. And you need to do it to Amy Relish. Now, this first giveaway, I believe, is for U.S. only. So this is going to be from elementvape.com. And if you're interested in finding out about this giveaway product, you can check out Mike Vape's review on it. This is the Aspire T. Is it Tigon or Tigon? Yep, right here. I think Mark's vaping on it. I got it right here, too. Yep. I got a review on it. T. Uh, oh, I did a Google thing on pronunciation. I can't remember if it was Tigon or Tigon. Anyway, Tigon, Tigon. Now, I'm, I made a mistake. It's Amy Relish COO <laughs> at gmail.com. So you yes. don't forget the COO um, at gmail.com if you win. All right. So, Mark, do us a favor pick up number 191. Run it through your computer, spit out a name, read it incorrectly, and we're going to congratulate the winner from elementvape.com. Now, you must be a U.S. resident for this giveaway only. You already said that three times! Look at this fucking pepper in my nose. It's driving me nuts. I didn't suck it up my nose. Oh, God. Oh, give me Why? a number. Do we have any other giveaways? Yes, we do. Okay. Uh, 191, Mark. 191. Here we go, folks. Keep your pants on because it's going to get nasty. And I'm trying to sneeze, but I can't. 191 is. Holy shit. People are going to think this show is definitely rigged when I say this name. Can you whisper it to me? No. You ready? Whis whisper it. Whisper it. Fagan Industries. <laughs> I'm not shitting you. Fagan Industries. Congratulations, Fagan Industries. You've Whatever won the, the giveaway. Is, you are the winner. I guess we finally get to find out who it is if he doesn't piff it. Uh, Steven Eagles, 999. He said, Brian, why don't you just put up a screenshot of the formatting before every giveaway for people who can't follow directions? Because the truth is, whether you say it, type it, or even tattoo it into their body, they're not going to follow directions because people are just fucking like that. So, but uh -huh. good, good recommendation though. I appreciate it. All right, Fagan Industries, congratulations. You just won the Aspire Tigon from well, elementvape.com. Fagan Industries doesn't always says that he's in North Korea. So I wonder if he really is in North Korea. He is well, in North Korea. If it is really Fagan Industries, then it really is. Oh awesome. yeah. There All right. Go. We're going to do another giveaway. That's going to be us only giveaway. This one is compliments of hit that juice.com. Ooh, and, oh, let me grab it. My bad, my bad. I almost forgot it. There we go. Compliments of hit I will be giving away. Actually, hit that juice.com is giving away. Bam. Ooh, nice. A rebirth, a purple rebirth RDA, and a bottle of Boston Cream. To a lucky winner. Very sweet. That's and a very sweet setup. All right, let's choose a number, folks. We're going to do, I see that we only have 206 likes, thumbs up. Why only 206? We got 740 watching. So let's do 206. If we hit 550, I will bulk this Adidas shirt. 550. All right, guys, get those fucking thumbs up. 550 thumbs up and Mark will bulk. And this is authentic. This ain't no flea market adidas shirt like st wears it's the real deal i'm trying to not eat as much and whenever mark bulks i don't eat for like 24 hours after there you go mark how old are you uh 13 nice dude it's fucking pepper yep that's what happens when you sniff <sighs> it <sighs> uh chester a millionaire he said does that one change colors mike Yes, it's a chameleon style RDA. Yes. Very nice. That's a little racist, but all right. It's like cross color shirts. Mm -hmm. Love that, dude. When uh, I used to wear cross color stuff, I would always have like this, like. All right, let me keep it real. Remember back in the day, like t-shirts were really long. 
Whenever I'd wear cross color shirts, I'd always have like a heat signature around my dick. I don't know why. I guess I have a lot of heat down there. <laughs> but there'd always be like this one heated area right where my dick was, and you could see the outline. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. It happened. Uh, Fagan Industry said Piffit because my. Uh, <laughs> he said my identity can't be known. I knew he didn't want to know who we do. He doesn't want to know. He, oh, shut the fuck up. This pepper is driving me nuts. Yep. He doesn't right. want you to know who he is. Yep. All right, Mark, so pick another 191. This is for the Element Vape giveaway. You need to contact Amy Relish, COO at gmail.com. If you win, U.S. residents only. And obviously, Fagan Industries is in North Korea. I think I got pepper in my lung. Here we go. <coughs> uh, winner. Jimmy Rose. Jimmy Rose. What did Jimmy Rose win? Uh, Element Vape giveaway. Okay. Yep. Elemento Vapo El Giveaway O. All right, Jimmy Rose, congrats. Didn't we say that the pips are going to be done by uh, email or something? Good job, Brian. Brian did say that last week. You're right. Yeah, their email. I've I've said it all night. Amy Relish, CEO of gmail.com. We missed a fucking donation. Uh, 999 Stephen Eagles? No, there was another one from. Oh, fuck. Scroll up and let's see. Anyway, Jimmy Rose, congrats. Uh, you won that uh, Aspire Tegon kit. Contact Amy Relish, COO at gmail.com. Name, address, phone number, email address, date of birth, zodiac sign, and social security number. Yes. I can't believe you missed that. All right, next one we're going to do now is uh, we're going to do number 206. That's the number I had said. 206 right. for the rebirth giveaway. Can that person type what they wrote and not, not in a donation format, and I'll see it and I'll know who it was, please? Here we go. 206, folks, is going to be Dashnit. Dashnit. Dash Schmidt. If you live in the U.S., comment in the chat. Does he live in the U.S., Mark? Probably not. Why? I'm just I'm going with either Polish or Russian. I mean, there's probably not a difference, but congratulations to Dash Schmidt, if I'm saying that correctly. <sighs> That's for you. Dash Schmidt, if you live outside the country, uh, you could pay for shipping if you want. How many thumbs ups do we have right now? Uh, 449. It's not going to happen. Not going to happen. Dashnit is from Michigan. All right, Dashnit. <laughs> email me at hitthatjuice at gmail.com. Name, address. <clears throat> uh, what else do I need? E- name, address. That's it. And uh, picture ID. Make sure you're of age. Yeah, whoever donated it was like New Zealand currency or Sweden or something. He wrote something about the drop solo RTA. What so, what did it say? Something. That's all I read. It was going so quick. Damn it. I don't like when people donate and we don't read it off. It's like yeah. they wasted their money. Well, it went so quick. Uh, it was like a dollar. Fuck. How quick it went. It didn't even go up on top. So it wasn't a lot, but still, I understand. Um, Fagan Industries said I think he was joking with you like the way we say the drop version 2 coming out oh yeah yeah. Uh, Fagan Industries made a comment and they said uh, oh it said uh, David Carlson he said oh shit my drop solo RDTA just exploded version 2 type type, type X1 in chat to ban Mike Vapes hashtag (laughs) TVP revenge so there you go whatever that means There there you go so thank you very much um, David Humston, five dollars. He said, "Got my top side dual, my top dual, and dropped dead in today. Freaking love the setup. Super comfortable in my hand. My rebirth and BTFC are both chilling in drip mode. Thank you all. Well, thank you. We really appreciate oh, yeah. it. Thank you. We want to make you happy. And speaking of making you happy, we're going to do that right now with a little bit of flesh. Yes. Oh, uh, Mark just took off sweatpants." Dude, my pants are tight and hot. See that little dick, baby. 
I am sporting some beautiful Adidas underwear tonight. Oh, look at that little strip show. There you go. <clears throat> I'm hoping that one day Adidas finds me. <laughs> Mark's the kind of dude you find behind a dumpster and he stands up and you're like, what was he shedding? And then another dude stands up right after. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what's the next? Are we doing another giveaway? Um, no. Okay. That's it for tonight. Uh, Leo I... Barry, $5. He said, fact, snorting pepper doesn't always make you sneeze, but it always burns. It yeah. burns and it tickles. Yep. Now, if really? it was powdered, was it powdered? Yeah, it was just regular table pepper shit. If it's not powdered, it ain't going to make you sneeze. The powdered one will make you sneeze. The regular old? Yeah, it might not be powdered. I don't know. Oh, goodness gracious. So, uh-huh. uh, Papa Lazaro would like to thank you for the topside duel he won. He thinks you're the cutest ever and would like to give you a spooch. If you want to see his lovely shout out, look at Planet of the Vapes Forum in the UK. So, there you go. Planet of the Vapes Forum in the UK. That's a pretty big, pretty, uh, Mark, big forum. Mark does mouth hug dumpster dates according to Ill State 815. I've actually gotten a blowjob behind a dumpster once but i wouldn't surprise what was his name she puked right afterwards which was kind of funny i'm not sure if it was because i was disgusting or she was just a junkie probably a little bit of both (laughs) i feel like a worse person on the show sometimes (laughs) you ever feel that when watching the show guys like you're you're selling a little part of yourself away yeah i do i do too all right, let's get them likes up. I'm going to give uh, three more minutes for us to hit 550, or we're not going to do the bulk. That's all there is to it. But up, thank God. Because these shirts are not cheap, folks. <laughs> fresh crap. We don't have anything fresh in this house. Mark, Mark is, is not racist. racist. He has a colored TV. <laughs> Oh, God, Brittany. <laughs> uh, sec is Swedish. 75 is $8.30. Okay, it didn't stay up there. Usually anything, or is it, oh, it's, I think it's maybe under 10 anything under $10. I thought it was, for some reason, I thought it was on $1 or $2. It doesn't stay up on the top part. da all right, we're gonna give this a shot. More than likely, it ain't. It's only four hundred and eighty. No! Oh, oh. <laughs> man down! Oh, are you ruining that fucking t-shirt, man? Oh, That's that a was, good one. Don't do it, one. man. I'm not able to rip it. Oh, that fucking hurts. <laughs> you committed. Wow. I'll tell you that. You went for it. See, that's why I buy these shirts because they're good. <laughs> You yeah, I don't think that. I'm ripping this one. Well, now the neck is fucking stretched, so you might as well try. <sighs> this is going to hurt. No! Oh, no, 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 no! Ah, fucking whore! Oh, I think my fingers are bleeding. <laughs> You're going to re-injure that fucking blue thumb of yours. <laughs> Dude, he commits. I'll tell you, I got to give him credit. <laughs> He's going to have a sore nose and ripped up fucking hands after this show no, and pulled muscles. One. Dude, I'm not doing it. There ain't no way. Mark versus T-shirt. Fight! Oh, fuck. <laughs> T-shirt wins. Flawless victory. All right, Mark, one more time. Finish him. Uh, <laughs> try. Dude, all right, let me try this way. Hold on. Uh, this is the Come on, best. Dude, come on, cheat. Cheat. Grab a scissor and just cut it a little. Ah. <laughs> yeah. It's like he's in a fucking special hospital trying to get out of his straitjacket. <laughs> Dude, I gotta say, he's been right the whole time. Those shirts are the good quality ones. Uh-huh. Scissors, Mark. Oh, well, it's me. we got a donation. Tyler Rose, he said, do the punk Stacy Dare. I think he means the pig Stacy Dare. Dude, this... I'm burning <laughs> from the pepper. Now my fingers are burning. Oh, man, Mark. I don't know what we do without you, bro. It's not possible. That fucking hurt. <laughs> it's like a physical challenge. 
if I just slowly do it? Rip it off like you're just showing yourself off slowly in sex. Oh my god! <laughs> Look how stretched out it is. <laughs> it's like a 38 waist now around his neck. It's like a V-neck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you keep pulling it downward, you're going to have cleavage showing. I could try to... Rip... <sighs> <laughs> He's going to be so sore tomorrow. <sighs> Dude. <laughs> I can't do a bulk with the shirt on. Sorry, guys. I tried. Dave M. Dave M., you nailed it. Bulkamania is dead. Yep. This is the end. Hogan would be no. really disappointed. I can I only think. bulk the cheap. Everybody's saying to cut it. Everybody wants you to cut it now. That's cheating. They want you to just snip it just a little bit. Just to, just No, to... I, got, I got to try to do it the correct way. Just, I can't cheat. Uh, Romeo Davias, $2. Macho Man Randy Savage would turn in his grave. That's true. <laughs> Look at his little fucking special arms. <laughs> I can't do it. Hold on. Dude, oh. Cut a little hole in the middle of it and come out of it like the alien. It's like he's wearing a fucking tent. <laughs> My God. Dude, those Adidas shirts are built like fucking... <laughs> Look at him. Oh, my God. That's going to be Mark Vape Team 2022. <laughs> <laughs> I can't fucking rip it. He's going to end up kicking through that shirt and knocking his whole desk over. Is there a hole in the arm, or what is that? There's a hole in the armpit. Yeah, that's where your arm goes through. Oh, never mind. <laughs> you got it stretched out so much. It's like a fucking black garbage bag. <sighs> Dude, you look like a T-Rex with an eating disorder. Oh, my God. It's like a pool tarp over him. Yeah. <sighs> I mean, hold on. <laughs> Well, folks, you get the best content on this show, the Vape Team Thursday Nights. <laughs> use a lighter, Mark. You'll be safe. Go ahead. Use a lighter. You know, Mark's right now like, oh, I need a cigarette. Oh, wait. I got something. I got something. I found the weak spot on the shirt. He's going to rip it ass first. It's we've seen we, Mike. We've seen this before. You are one pathetic loser. These are good. I these are good. That's not good as shit at all anymore. Dude, you're mm. supposed to be a fucking athlete. I know exactly. What kind of what kind of what if Marcus was watching? Would you be proud of yourself right now? Oh my god, dude, these fucking sh I think we've defeated him tonight, folks. He's literally... He, look, hold on, hold on. I got to do this. Spotlight video. He is fucking sweating. I am breaking a sweat. It actually looks pretty nice like this. It looks horrible. It looks absolutely pathetic. <coughs> Anything else, Mark? Are you, you, you tapping out? I think I'm done. I can't do it. All right, so you're giving up. Is that what you're saying? I'll wear the same shirt next week, and I'll try again. All right, we're going to do this every week until you get it. We're going to help you beat this demon. We'll do it again. Uh, Doug Douglas Roach, $5. If Marks keeps straining like that, he's going to end up flushing another pair of underwear <laughs> down the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> he probably already did. Uh, I have a fucking headache from laughing. <laughs> he's not fucking doing himself. Dude, he's going to pop a fucking blood vessel. I'm done. It ain't working. 
Uh, Ram Vapes uh, just donated five dollars. He said, "I would love to know where the T-shirt, where that T-shirt is made. I would be surprised if it's made in China." Dude, this is a, some good Chinese material. That's made in Pakistan. I could see a, a, a that that is true. Um, there could be an Adidas workout video coming out soon with Mark ripping shirts off. Um, Luis Simo uh, gave two dollars. He said, "Mark Fagan as the Incredible Bulk." More like a disappointing bulk. That's a good look for you. You look trim, man. Look at that. He just sucked in his stomach. Yep. Let it out, Mark. Just let it hang. <laughs> you you suck it in. <laughs> All righty. I can't tear a fucking shirt. What the fuck is wrong with me? Holy shit. <clears throat> Are you not entertained, everyone? Let's give Mark a round of applause. A for effort. But I can tell you this. Mike and I will not confuse his effort with the results because the results were horrible. So the only so thing he was missing was the football helmet. Yep. We need to get him a football <laughs> helmet. Gregory Brown, $5. Stretch that Adidas symbol any further. Trump has his wall. So there you go, Gregory Brown. There you go. All right, guys. Well, that's it. Cloudy Entertainment, Thursday night. 191 is now behind us. We have finished another excellent week on the vape team. And this show would not be possible without each and every one of you. Those that join us in the Facebook group for the vape team, those that come and chat every week, those that don't go and chat and just like to hang out and watch the show, those that watch the replay, we'd like to thank you. We'd like to thank our sponsors. We'd like to thank Mark for his craziness. We'd like to thank Mike for his sexiness. And we'd like to thank the relish for all the hard work she puts in. Ah! He got it. He got yes. It. <laughs> I can't do it anymore. Come on, you fucking. You got animal. it. You fucking pussy. Punch it. Punch it, Mark. Do it. Do it, man. Do it. Prove Rip it to Marcus! Prove Mark. it to Marcus! Rip that shit off you! Those dudes that used to say you couldn't last long in the sack, do it for them! Yes! yes. yes. <laughs> Woo! Oh, I need a fucking vacation now. <sighs> That's the kind of effort we have on this show, ladies and gentlemen. We are cloud committed. <sighs> I might need to drink tonight after the show, fellas. Yes. <laughs> Um, let's all contact Mark tomorrow and make sure he's okay. We know for a fact he's going to have sore muscles, tears on his hands. So, Thank you, thank you. He did that for you. I feel like a winner tonight. Beautiful. <laughs> Dude, those right, fucking Alex. Adidas shirts. All right, now it's time to get the whipped cream out. <laughs> all right, Mark, grab the whipped cream, grab the dodo, and head outside. <laughs> Both lives. Next. Everybody's bulk lives. The bulk is back, baby. The bulk is back, baby. It only took 30 minutes. Uh-huh. Both Damn. lives matter. Ooh. Okay. Wow. <laughs> He's got a mod holder. <laughs> <laughs> How you feeling, Mark? I feel great. You look good. You look like you're uh, basking in the in the field of battle. I look healthy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're the spitting image of fit and, fit and polished. The eye of the tiger. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, man. Awesome. All right, guys. Well, 191 is going to go down in the history books. It's one of the greatest shows we've ever had, if not the greatest show. This shit just keeps getting better. We're almost at 200 shows, and the content never stops. We keep you entertained. We fucking love you. We thank you. Anything else? Yeah, Mark, you should, grab a, you should grab a Hungry Man TV dinner and use your belly as a tray. Celebrate. Yep. Celebrate with a TV dinner, folks. <sighs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. Bye. Good night. Bye. All right, Mark, go grab some fucking Advil. 20 minute oh, outro perfect. begins now. Oh, his fucking neck is red as fuck, too. Dude, it looks like he's been out in the sun on the fucking Walmart patio furniture. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait till he starts doing his Walmart patio reviews in the spring. Oh, that's gonna be the best. Yep. 
this shirt would not rip. Holy fuck. Yo, Mike, we should travel to Chicago and take pictures of that wig that he stole and put wanted posters in the neighborhood like we're looking for a lost dog, but for, for the wig. <laughs> put it through the trailer park. Oh, my God. Anybody see my wig? All right, I need a war- wardrobe change. Mark, if you were in Jersey, I'd suck your prick right now. <laughs> I would. You deserve it, man. I'd suck your fucking prick. Oh, my God. I'd suck your prick, too, Mike. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll suck all each other's pricks. Dude, Mike, he was not confident at all when he was no, talking he, about he, question he one. That. Yeah, he was... Yeah. That was a questionable long pause. Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh, with the threesome part? Yep. Oh, yeah. He had to the, think about that. Oh. There's some secrets. Mm-hmm. Mm. That was a good show. I had fun. You? Yeah. 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 All right, we're going to end it. Bye, guys. Bye.